Hey friends, Donovan here with FretSpot.com. I have another really, really cool pedal today. Um, when I first got this, I was kind of like, eh. <laughs> I don't know. It's kind of small, and it's, you know, it's a mid-control. It's a bass mid-control. I, I don't know how much interest I have in this. And I've been playing around with it. Dang, this thing is cool. Uh, it's Don't let it small size fool you. This thing is, like, wicked, wicked cool. Um, essentially, all it is, I mean, it is, like, you know, it's a mid-control. Um, however, you can do a couple really cool things with it. Um, first of all, you can set the mid frequencies that you're adjusting on this dial here, and then you can boost and cut on this dial. So you can see we got two different uh, dials here, two different concentric knobs here. And um, anyways, so um, and some of this I'm going to just kind of read off of their website. But um, if you're using a, a two-band bass, like you know, there's a lot of guys out there using two-band preamps stuff like that, or if you're using um, maybe you want a bass that you can or a, 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 use this so you can sw quickly switch to like a great slap sound or something like that. This is perfect for that. And um, what they do is when you have this thing, this uh, this control here set in various settings, you're going to control the hertz that it's um, uh, changing, and you can control anything from 120 hertz down to three kilohertz, which is really cool. So when you're over uh, all the way to this section, you're going to be at 120 hertz, and then like we get in a nine o'clock position, 160 hertz. Going on all the way to, to um, you know, right about uh, here is about 800 hertz, which is a popular frequency that a lot of guys like to adjust and use. And then all the way to the end would be the, the 3 kilohertz, and um, which is really, really pretty amazing to do that. Um, they talk about on the website how you can, like if you want like a just a killer, like kind of fretless, what they call the fretless virtuoso sound, you'd set it about like, um, about like that. And uh, to give you a lot of mid range, and I'll, I don't have a fretless here to, to demo this exactly, but uh, I'll uh, demo what the sound is like at least. And then if you want like a killer slap sound, um, they suggest um, something more like this is easier for me to do when I'm looking at it. Something like this. So we've got the the mid over in the, this range, which is probably in the about that 800 kilohertz range, and then uh, we're sucking some of that out. Um, get a chunk of that out for killer slap sounds. So for such a tiny pedal, um, it's really versatile. You can get just some amazing sounds out of it. It's green, which is kind of cool. Um, it's a small form factor, which is real. I think is really nice. These are again handmade in Japan. They're uber high quality. They're all metal construction, true bypass, uh, really really slick. So, uh, anyways, let's check this bad boy out, shall we? Thank <laughs> you. 
So there you had it. That was the uh, this is the EWS uh, bass mid control pedal. Uh, if this is something that you could use, then drop me a line and uh, I'll be glad to get one for you. Uh, Donovan at fretspot.com. As always, thanks for watching. Appreciate it.